The LAPD warning people about a rise in residential burglaries on LA's west side. Thieves are targeting upscale neighborhoods with the most recent incident happening just last night in Bel Air. KTLA's Aaron Myers live from the Sawtell area mm. with the latest. Aaron, good morning. Mm -hmm. Good morning to you both. This alert is for residents who live in areas like Bel Air, Brentwood and Westwood. This is due to the increase in these residential burglaries. We'll go ahead and get into video from a recent incident. This happened on Saturday and you can see three masked men trying to break into a home on the 2400 block of Roscoe Road, though it's believed six people were actually involved. They were armed with tools, but were said to be scared off by the LAPD responding overhead. The suspects were gone by the time the police officially arrived and in Brentwood on Friday night, Friday night on the 300 block of South Bundy, police were seen at home at a home where it's believed another break in happened while the residents were inside. We are trying to get more information about this incident. Also in Brentwood on the 15th of this month, the LAPD could be seen at a home on San Vicente Boulevard and helicopter above as officers looked around. It's believed residents were home once again when masked intruders broke in. We're working on getting details on this as well. Now, the LAPD um, and the Santa Monica Mirror, they tell us the LAPD has issued an alert. They say thieves are taking off with items like jewelry, handbags and cash. Authorities say these appear to be organized crews of two to four males that target homes, which appear to be unoccupied, using things like ladders and outdoor furniture to get to upper floors. They cut out glass to get inside and ransack rooms looking for valuables and oftentimes have a getaway vehicle with someone acting as a lookout. Now, these vehicles are usually rentals with dealer plates or stolen plates according to police. Police say they're also using Wi-Fi jammers to disrupt the Wi-Fi signal of residential security cameras and using handheld radios to communicate. Now, there are some recommendations for residents, include installing video surveillance systems, securing sliding glass doors and bolting down safes. It's even a good idea to equip those safes with GPS tracking devices. Residents are also encouraged to participate in community watch programs and to check your backyards and home's perimeter for hidden recording devices. Now, back here live, police are also encouraging residents to keep in contact with one another, share information, and to be on alert for drones in their neighborhood. Reporting live here in Sotel, I'm Erin Myers. I'll send it back to you both in the studio.